and this is one of Cape Town's main sources of water, a source to run out of water. Officials in Cape Town, South Africa say... The city has entered a phase where it is anticipated the real possibility of day zero. Cape Town's flirtation with day zero brought the apocalyptic future promised by Hollywood producers crashing into our realities. And last month, Shimla gave India its own Cape Town moment. But according to the latest report by Niti Aayog, this is just the tip of the iceberg. With 75% of households still without access to drinking water at their premises, India is ranked 120th out of 122 countries on the Quality of Water Index. Today, 600 million Indians are living under extreme water stress. This means they are unable to meet their human and ecological demand for fresh water. What complicates matters is, this region produces 20 to 30% of the country's food and threatens national food security. Additionally, 54% of India's groundwater wells are declining. Of the accessible water, 70% is contaminated. And as a result, 200,000 people die every year due to inadequate access to safe drinking water. While more than 90% of the urban population has had access to basic water since the year 2000, by 2020, 21 major cities including Delhi, Bangalore, Chennai, Hyderabad are expected to run out of groundwater, affecting 100 million people. By the year 2030, demand will be double of the available supply and 40% of the population will not have access to drinking water. And by 2050, 6% of GDP will be lost due to the water crisis. In short, if we don't change our consumption patterns, policy and mindset, we are fucked.